lock short, lock long, and a question that so many people have asked us, where is my fascia tight? Okay, so I want you to take a much bigger picture approach regarding the word tight, and I'm going to use the opposite of tight is taut, being pulled. Okay, so let's look at the fascial trains and how this can affect you. So you can see these fascial trains go all the way up to the head from your feet through your spine all the way up to your head. So I want you to imagine what I am doing to the head and all the way down to the foot if I create that fascia restriction, right, that we like to demonstrate, right? So the head is being pulled over, this is tight, there's a lot more compression. With this pattern, all the weight bearing is on the right side and much less weight bearing on the left and the left side is taut and the right side is tight. So let's free Aaron up and I'm just gonna talk about it here for a second. So I want you to imagine that there's a pulley right here at the head. And if I am pulling Aaron to the right, right, the entire, from his head to his feet, everything is contracting, all the weight shifts over to the right, and what that creates is that the right side is locked short and tight, and the left side is bowing and stretching and is locked long and is taut. Lock long versus lock short when it comes to fascia. So, let's go ahead and do to this fishing rod, and Aaron's going to follow along here, right? So, in this position, the fishing rod doesn't have any tension on it. It is fine. Now, if there is a pull on the right, so there's bend to the right and the fascia restriction on the right, can you see, right, that right side is pulling? Can you see what's happening on the left? Can you see that bowing on the left? So let me ask you a question. If someone comes to me and they have this kind of pattern, just like Aaron is doing here, but they have left hip pain over there on the other side, should I release them on the left, stretch them, do fascia manipulation or anything of that sort on the left? If I do, let's bend a little further, Aaron, because that's what we're doing. We're loosening this up further so it's going to collapse the system more and cause more tension through the system. The solution is to work the restriction on the right and slowly bring everything back up to center and reduce the tension in the entire system okay so one more time don't be fooled right if it's bent to one side you may have massive symptoms on the other side we call that don't open pandora's knot because if you do you may get temporary relief on that left side in this case but you're going to destabilize the system further and long term cause more problems